outlook for this team adding GG? I mean, do they do they go from probably a bottom of the SEC type of team? Does 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 one player, does one GG Jackson equate possibly being in the postseason? Is he does he make that big of an impact? Well, I'd see, and that, and that's hard to do because I don't I don't necessarily know what the baseline was. I don't know what Lamont Paris does with SEC talent in the right. SEC as a coach. Mm-hmm. Um, so it could have he could have taken the roster he currently had and been a middle of the tier team because of the the, the scheme and the mm. the plays that he runs the buy in the hard the hard knock stuff that they do um or, or they could have been bottom i don't know yeah. um, so it's kind of it's kind of hard to see how he elevates them and when you don't know what the baseline is but with that being said um he certainly helps i know he'll help with the perception i know he'll help around the city mm. i know the city of columbia wants to get around their own mm. um especially if their own stays local. So I'm sure this is going to help with local businesses and um, all that type of stuff kind of buying in. Um, I'm sure it's going to help with ticket sales. Again, a local kid with 15 minutes up the road playing for the local university, um, his family, friends, and everybody can come watch. So I'm sure it's going to help with ticket sales as well. And there's going to be a buzz to be able to capitalize on. We'll see what the social media team um, is able to do surrounding the buzz and the capitalization of having a local kid and the local buy-in, um, you know, with this stuff. Everything else, it, it, they just need to show progress on the court. As long as they continue to what they are in October, is better in November, better in December, better in, in February, and continue the progression and stuff, um, I think it could be a successful season. 